In this video, we're going to look at how to sort a hash. Now, as I've said in other videos pertaining to hashes, they're inherently not sorted, so they're not ordered. And when we create one here, especially in RB, it gives us the illusion that it's ordered, but it's, it's really not necessarily that way stored internally. So if you try to rely on that, like iterating across it and expecting it to be in some kind of ascending value, you might get burned by doing that. So you may have to sort it if, if you need some kind of sorted structure. The problem is when you sort a hash, you don't get a hash back that's sorted. You get an array with each element of that array being uh, a small array of two values. So let's go ahead and demonstrate that. Launch in the IRB here. The first, let's go ahead and create our color. Actually, I, I think the first thing I'm going to demonstrate is an error here. So I'm going to give you look here what we get if we just try to sort this and it's going to come up and say undefined method and it's the comparator operator for a symbol well it doesn't know how to evaluate these symbols remember symbols aren't strings so these aren't going to be evaluated alphabetically or, or any other way it doesn't ruby doesn't know how to compare two symbols together so if if you need to do something like that you could give it a, a block and so you're going to get an A and a B as it compares across the, the uh, structure and those are going to be the keys that so this will be one key and this will be the next key that it's comparing to to actually set up th your sword here and so what you want to do is probably if you want to evaluate it as a string is put it to a string then give it the comparison operator and now what it's going to do is going to convert these symbols into a string and then do the sort on it and then the comparison inside the sort method and order it by essentially the alphanumeric order of, of those symbols. So there we have it ordered. Now you can see what we get back. It's not a hash. It's an array. Here's our brackets on the end here of each element being an array of two values inside there and those happen to be your your key and your value so this is no longer a hash so just be aware of that using a sort that you you get this hash here now let's create something that's a little bit better here i created a hash that i'm using a r e g as my values my hash and you can see how it reordered it for me so even though I put it in this way, thinking, oh, there's my order, it already reordered it, and I'm not even guaranteed that's going to be necessarily order if I need to do something with it. And where you really get in the trouble is when you're putting stuff into the hash and you're thinking that it's in the order that you've put that stuff in, and it's not. The, the hash has its own in, in structure in there. So if we can do a sort on here, that, that's going to work because these keys are comparable to each other. You can compare two strings to one another straight up and you have no problem with that. And the same thing would be if we were to use numbers. So the key thing to remember is that when you're sorting a hash, result of that sort is not a hash. It's an array with each element being an array of two elements.